This tutorial is on color. The most important colors, of course, are the ones that you use. No, wait. This tutorial is on color. Color in the GIMP. Okay, so here we have a sample of my face. My beautiful, beautiful face. And here is a picture from Disneyland of my face in the sunlight. What we want to do is we want to make these two the same kind of brilliance. So, layer. I'm going to crop myself out for my friends. I'm going to move me over here just a touch. There we go. Now, I'm going to keep your attention over here to the layer section. This is to keep in mind, whichever layer is selected is the one that I will be editing. I want to adjust the background layer. So I select that one and I go to the color tab. Now, I get rid of the green and the blue layer. I can now see just the red layer. Keep in mind again, this background is selected. You know, it doesn't matter what I have highlighted here. So let's go to levels. Now in the levels, it's very important to make sure you select the red layer you're working with to make the adjustments. Now if you see, the adjustments I make affect only the back layer, not the front layer. Let's see, get, get as close as I can. That looks pretty good. Okay. Now, if you want to, you can write this down. So I'm going to do that. I'm going to do red 8 1.38 and 210. The next one, of course, will be green and blue. Okay, so let's just minimize that, not worry about that. Okay, now let's go to the red channel again. The background is the only thing highlighted. Layers, colors, levels, value, green. I'll bring that up. Bring that up, and that looks about right. I think for me, it looks all right. Green is eight, 1.22, and two, 13. Very similar numbers, actually. Okay. Then the last layer is blue. As you can see, blue is probably the most drastic blue. bring that there we go it looks pretty good so we bring up the paper again this time it's zero one point four four two two nine I'm keeping these around because I can apply these color settings to my video feeds in Caden Live much better color much better saturation everything looks more natural of course then you can fine-tune I usually do so I'm just going to bring that in like that. And that looks good. I like that one. But there you have it. There's some color working. The thing is, if you use this tutorial to correct your color in the GIMP, you can bring those settings into Kane Live and go from this picture quality to this picture quality. Much better. Okay, so this is my uh, tutorial on color.